My son and his breakfast. My son was about four years old and he gets hungry first thing when he wakes up. He kept getting up and yelling at his mom demanding breakfast I had a conversation with him telling him that he couldn't talk to his mom that way and he couldn't yell at her first thing in the morning to make him breakfast the next morning he wakes up, comes into the bedroom and says, hey mom, I'm not gonna yell at you to make me breakfast. Then he went and sat at the table and waited for his breakfast I couldn't stop laughing all morning. Haha <laughs> that's perfect. Kids are smart AF. When I was around 3 I asked for ice cream. It was right before dinner and my newly divorced father was mashing potatoes. No mate it's almost dinner. Go set the table. I come back a couple minutes later. Hey dad do you love me? Yes. Do you love sister? Yes. Do you love mom? Yes. Do you love? And it went on and on. All the relatives. The dogs etc. Can I have an ice cream? Yes. Shit. I got ice cream and a new word tears of joy. It was about 1980. I was 9 years old. I had done something my dad wasn't too happy about. And he came home from work in a pretty foul mood. While we all still talk about this story, nobody remembers, including me, what I did to piss my dad off. My mom was in the kitchen making dinner. And I decided to help. As it was easier to avoid my dad and his mood, my mom went through the house for something. And I stayed in the kitchen, stirring the green beans while they cooked. My dad said something that I didn't understand. As my mom came back into the kitchen, my mom took the wooden spoon from my hand and nonchalantly told me to ask my dad if he was on the rag. I asked my mom, what does that mean? She said, don't worry, he'll know. Our house was kind of a straight line, from the kitchen, through the dining room to the living room, with the bedrooms and bathroom on the side. I walked through the house, to the living room doorway, and asked, Dad, are you on the rag? He yelled, what did you say to me? Then flung a two-liter bottle of coke at me. I ducked around the doorframe as the bottle sailed through the dining room, sliding into the kitchen. My mom burst out laughing. My dad yelled, Damn it, Op's mom's name. Why can't you ever take me disciplining the kids seriously? She said, Well, then stepped on the two liter bottle. It rolled, causing her to fall on her can. In the kitchen. Then they both burst out laughing. I stood in the dining room wondering what the F was happening. The mood lightened. We had a nice dinner. They never explained what the rag was. So that took a couple more years. Kids will always go for the malicious compliance. Especially if it benefits them. For example, my dad would tell me to go tell your brother to get his ass home. I would tell him those exact words. Every time. With a big grin. To be fair, he was only told not to yell at her. Not to not wake her up. Set out crackers on the table the night before. Just needs a little snack. My toddler son loved Nutrigrain bars. So we put them in an accessible cabinet to allow him to help himself. He would get up and have one or two. And be satiated enough to wait for me to get my ass up and make him a proper breakfast or a bowl of cereal. Four-year-olds are the cutest face holding back tears. There's something so innocent and precious about them at this age still. Then they hit five and start becoming like a normal human and it's all downhill from there. How is this MC? You didn't end up making it. So where's the malicious compliance? So sweet. Kids will even eat roadkill. Future CEO. If your child is hungry you get up from bed and make breakfast what is he doing up alone? Or why don't you get up to make him breakfast? You're in followed his directions to the letter. 
As I think you realized, this is on you. My stupid kid did something stupid, stories are banned. Wasn't this posted yesterday from the mom's pov? Not malicious at all, he did exactly as you told him. How did you expect the next morning to go? If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.